Thank you for joining us. I'm Katharina Yancey. The City of Little Rock has teamed up with local students to make the city a little more brighter. Joining me now is Lamar Williams. He's the Communications and Marketing Manager with the City of Little Rock. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. So tell me about all of this came about. We are going to start seeing rocks around the city with some encouraging words and themes. Tell me about that. Yes, it's awesome. We're calling it Little Rocks. Uh, it's a way for us to promote what is awesome about Little Rock and the Little Rock School District. Uh, the Little Rock School District reached out to us uh, with this idea and uh, we thought it was awesome. So we wanted to just work with them and, and be encouraging to people and encourage people to get out and see and do and have fun. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to have little rocks uh, that are themed and it, whatever you want to paint on them as long as it's not obscene uh, and, um, and and hide them. And the, one of the things that we're going to do is we're going to hide the rocks and we're working with a lot of all of as many of local attractions as we can reach out to. Uh, for example, the Little Rock Zoo and um, and Wild River Country, for example. So we'll hide a lucky rock uh, over at the zoo. Uh, that'll be the Wild River Country lucky rock uh, hidden at the zoo somewhere on a specific specific day. Uh, and then at Wild River Country will be the zoo's lucky rock. So when you find those rocks, uh, you win a prize packet, a package. And then uh, throughout the community, we're going to encourage people to decorate their own rocks, paint them, um, make them fun, challenge your friends, challenge your family, uh, hide them in, the, in some of our parks or wherever you want to hide them around your house. Uh, take a selfie with the, with the rock and use the hashtag LRRocks and then you'll be entered in, in uh, to win a, a prize package as well. Also, we want to remind our viewers that Little Rock students have been working on rocks for, for months now. They have hundreds of rocks yes. ready to go, ready for the kickoff, and they're going to start putting them around the city. Are they going to start putting them in certain areas? Well, we haven't decided exactly where they're going to be. Of course, if you tell people, then that's not really much of a challenge. Uh, so we do want to kind of keep that a little secret, but they're, we, we're hoping that people will just kind of Pay a little more attention to their surroundings, pay a little more attention when they're out, and if you see one, you grab it, take a selfie, and you can keep it if you want to keep it, uh, or you can put it back and let someone else find it, or you can replace it with your own. It encourages people to get out, experience Little Rock, go to areas that maybe you, you haven't been before as yes, well. Yes, exactly. Yeah, you know, this is an awesome city, um, and we've had you know, some issues of late uh, that some people are concerned about, but we want people to know that this is a great place to live and Little Rock School District is a great great place to send your kids to school. This is a, a great way for the city to, to team up with students with the, the Little Rock School District as well. Exactly. Yeah, and you know, and it showcases their talents. You know, we have such talent in this city, including our young kids uh, and, and adults as well. I mean, some of the art teachers painted some of the rocks that are really awesome. Uh, and uh, so it's, we're just super excited to be doing this. This uh, seems like a pilot program. Is there any funding behind it right now, or do you just have a lot of great community support? It's just community support right now. Um, uh, we, I would say that uh, I think Carver got some rocks donated from, uh, I think, Home Depot. And uh, and so the kids were able to decorate those, and they were nice size, you know, not too big, not too small. Uh, so that was really awesome. And uh, the attractions are donating prize packages. Uh, tell me about when is there going to be like a, a ceremony uh, for the event? Yes, we're going to have a kickoff on May 13th at the River Market. You know, the Farmers Market is going to kick off soon, and also uh, in that week will be uh, sort of ending uh, uh, National Tourism Week. So we thought that would be a great way to encourage tourism, local tourism, you know, I mean, we'd have a staycation, you know, uh, spring, summer is coming. Uh, and so we want people to just get out and enjoy this city. And also there's so many talented people in the city. So tell me again, for anyone who wants to start designing rocks, uh, the hashtag, if you want, if you see yes. a rock, you can do a selfie with a rock, you yes. can design them. What's mm -hmm. that hashtag? Uh, the hashtag is uh, hashtag LR rocks. So L R R O C K S. Um, and then uh, once you do that, tag us, you know, obviously we're going to find you and we'll uh, enter you to win a prize. Thank you so much, Lamar Williams, with Thank the City you. of Little Rock for joining us today. Thank you. We will see you next time.